The first thing I do when I get up is uh, I just have a look out the window. I have a great view of Mauna Kea. If you can see the mountain, generally it's going to be a good day. Every day, uh, the goal is to get on sky, to, uh, to take some observations, to expose our CCDs to uh, photons of light. So my role at uh, Canada France Hawaii Telescope is uh, instrument designer and machinist. I've been here for six years, and prior to that, for six years, I built custom motorcycles. At Canada France, astronomy is the game. If you break it down into the core, what I do for astronomy is make parts. And parts are parts, whether they're car parts, bike parts, or, or telescope parts. In astronomy, the telescope is our main tool. So the only way for us to gather data, to gather information, is the light that is coming from far away in the universe. So we're trying to predict the evolution of the universe for the future. Greg is really important at CFHD. Uh, we are developing new instruments. Sometimes we need to think about solutions to improve the instrument, to make things work. With SOLIDWORKS, I can make a piece like this in an hour. And some of the competing products, it's, it's cumbersome. There's so much involved in getting something simple done. So whether it's, it's other telescopes or it's our partners that we, we work with to develop some of these instrumentation packages, uh, it just seems that everyone is using SOLIDWORKS. So it makes sharing this data much easier. My name is Truman Wold. I'm a mechanical engineer here at the WM Keck Observatory. Uh, which is in collaboration with Caltech and University of California system. Canada France is looking towards redesigning their telescope to go to a segmented primary mirror. And so they called up and they said, hey, any chance you can give us some information on your, on the way you've built yours. And so we have our model right here and it was easy enough for us to just, just shoot that over to them right away. What we're working on right now at Canada France is uh, we're gonna go ahead and cut the top of the observatory off recycle everything and put a, at least a 10 meter telescope up there. It'll be a segmented design, very similar to Kex. CFHD is funded by the National Science Foundation in Canada, the National Science Foundation of France, and the University of Hawaii. When we get to the summit, the very top of the mountain, 14,000 feet, it's, it's gonna be like nothing you've ever seen. One of the most recent discoveries that CFHT was involved in that was really impactful was Oumuamua. So Oumuamua was this tiny little, at first we thought it was an asteroid, now we think it's a comet, object from another solar system. So it's our very first interstellar visitor. So after about an hour of driving, we're gonna stop at our mid-level facility, Halepaku, and uh, we'll spend a half hour to an hour acclimating. All of the partners that we have, they're using SOLIDWORKS. And when we have a question or a problem that we think that the other organization might be able to answer, then we don't hesitate to pick up the phone. Once we hit the mid-level facility, the roads will turn gravel, very rough. As we're on the dirt road up the mountain, it's gonna start looking like Mars. Mauna Kea is the, the best place on the planet to put a ground-based telescope. The main reason for that is isolation. Isolation and elevation. The twin Keck telescopes are the most scientifically productive telescopes in the world. The suite of instruments that we have at our disposal. That's really what makes a telescope useful, is the instrumentation, what information that the astronomers can get out of that light that is collected. All of them these days are, are designed with SOLIDWORKS. Everyone here uh, plays a critical role in, in our success in getting this data. I'm just one single part. Everyone here from, from the janitor that cleans the place up to the PhD that analyzes the data once it comes off the telescope, we're all equally important. I'm an instrument engineer at the Canada-France Hawaii Telescope. And I basically maintain instruments up here. This is my baby, it's to tell. It's one of the newest instruments at our observatory. Like all instruments we get, there are a few uh, details missing and, and actually that's what Greg Green's up here for today. He's gonna be installing a part that we decided needs to be upgraded. So the WM Keck Observatory is right over my shoulder. Keck 1 is on the left, Keck 2 is on the right. 
you can see how close they are. They're only about a quarter mile away. Uh, very easy for us to uh, communicate. The mission of, of the Keck Observatory is to expand our knowledge of the universe and to share that discovery, all those discoveries that we have with the rest of the world in order to inspire the world to do other great things. SOLIDWORKS is allowing us to advance our facilities, our telescope, our instruments, all of the tools that we use in order to see every night. Our mission is to increase the ability of our instrumentation packages to, to see further and clearer than we've ever seen before. As our future plans evolve, we're going to move to a segmented mirror. Our relationship with Keck and their experiences with developing the segmented mirror, it's crucial that we share this data and develop that and refine it and perfect it along the way.